Yo, what is everyone, and welcome back to another video. In this video, I want to go over how to create some really cool or just, you know, basic um, custom backgrounds in Final Cut Pro 10. Now, before I knew about this, I just basically made backgrounds in like Photoshop or Canva, and then I imported them into Final Cut, and then obviously like changed the color uh, to what I deemed um, necessary uh, for said video. But I didn't realize you can actually create your own custom backgrounds um, in Final Cut Pro 10. So let's head over to the example um, right here. I'm going to go over here to titles and generators. So click on this icon right here. As you can see right here, here are a whole bunch of different backgrounds. So let's say we want to have some sort of um, cloud background. I'll go and just change this to like 110 or something like that. One ten or something like that. So you can see right there, as you can see, there you go. You have like a um, cloud, a cloud background um, right there. So obviously, as you can see right here, you could go through all of these different um, custom generators right here until you know you get the background um, that you want. If you want more, more like a custom background, but this is the uh, the one we'll talk about right now is this custom generator right here so we go ahead and apply this custom generator right here you go ahead and play the video but as you can see it still has um, a black background so you ask yourself okay, how in the world do I um, fix that so I go ahead and head right here as you can see I can play right here but it still has a black border even if I disable enables you can see right here nothing happens you still have that black background now if that's what you want then by all means just using like a black background but most of you probably don't want just a black background so I want to go ahead and just scale this out even a little bit more just so you can see what's happening see right there there's the black um, background so what you're going to do is you want to go ahead and click on the custom generator and then head over to this icon right here make sure you're on this icon and then as you can see right here here is the colors right here so you can go ahead and change the background to any color you want right there so you can change it to literally any color um, that you want right there so you can also go ahead and click on the thing right here as you can see where you can get like a more precise um, color right here you can go through and scroll through all of the different um, colors right there you can basically just select a different color background um, you want for your video so let's just say you want a yellow one right there so now for this one, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and just go right here I'm gonna type in like 900 right here and let's type in 500 right there because so you can see there you go now you kind of just cropped it right here so you can see there's Patrick Mahomes um, right there and we could scale it out to like 100 or 110 right there now you ask yourself okay so if I want to do that how do I center it so what you want to do is you want to go to view right here and you want to click on show horizons right there now granted actually I'll, I'll pick a different color because it's hard to see so I'll pick you know, maybe like a, a purple right there so now you, you know actually can see what's happening so when I go over here so you can see right here now it's show horizon now I can move the x-axis basically to center this right here so it looks pretty good um, right now now let's go ahead and create Create a copy right here now we can move this over here you can kind of just keep messing with it and then we can create a another copy right there and then move it over right here you can use a grid use a whole bunch of different things to make sure it's center but that looks pretty good for the sake of the video then we'll go to click off show horizons right here click on the custom generator and then now we can probably change it back to like a yellowish color um, right there as you can see right there, now you've created this really cool kind of like custom background um, in Final Cut Pro 10. You can of course mess with a whole bunch of different colors and different, you know, a scale, position, crop, whatever you want. You can kind of just keep messing with it until you get the look that you want. But just remember, go over here to Title and Generators. Head over here to custom generators right here apply the custom generator right here click on it put it underneath the clip obviously adjust the scale go over to this icon right here and then change the color to any color you want and you can also click on it right here and we get like a more precise reading of said color right there and there you go 
it's as simple as, as a simple you can create a very simple um background right there i originally like i said before i used to use like canva or stuff like that to like you know get like different colored backgrounds if i want kind of like a border effect but i didn't realize you can actually just do this right into final cut pro 10. simple as that just a custom generator change the color adjust the adjust the crop adjust the scale adjust the position until you get the look that you want every clip is going to be different now great if you want to do uh this kind of like split sp uh, split screen you want to make sure the subject uh stays pretty close like stays pretty much in the same position or else it's going to be really hard to create a split screen that goes for all split uh, split screens you want to make sure the subject stays pretty much in the same position or else it's not going to work so there you go that's how you create some really cool custom backgrounds in final cut pro 10 anyways hopefully you enjoyed this video hopefully you found it helpful and informative if you're new to this channel i upload final cut pro 10 tutorials every day at 10 a.m eastern standard time so if you enjoy these types of videos consider hitting that subscribe button also a final cut pro 10 tutorial playlist with over 210 Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials. So definitely go ahead and check out that playlist. Anyways, see you in the next one. Peace.